In this video, we're going to cover external style sheets. How to place an external style sheet in your document and how to move styles from one style sheet to another. Right now we're in Dreamweaver CS4 looking at the index page of webnewbie.com. As you can see in our body of text here, there aren't really any styles added. It's kind of just placed out there and doesn't look very pretty. Luckily, we've already created an external style sheet and we're going to place that in here in a moment. But first I want to take you over to the CSS Styles panel so we can see a couple things. Right now under the CSS Styles panel under All, we've already got an external style sheet created, which is probably what's centering this and keeping the web newbie and the navigation all intact. The next thing we have is just an internal style sheet. We can tell it's an internal style sheet because there is no .css afterwards. There has to be a .css afterwards for it to be an external one. And the fact that it just says style right here. Also, furthermore, we can check it in the code view by scrolling up a little bit. And as you can see, here is a style placed inside of the document itself named header. Going back to design view, we'll close that up right now. We're going to insert our external style sheet in order to give this page a little bit of life. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to the little chain link uh, icon over here in the CSS Styles panel, and I'm going to attach a new style sheet. I'll go ahead and click on that. And right now, I've already got the style sheet that I want selected. In order to find this style sheet, we can click on Browse, go into our wherever your style sheet is located. Mine's located in the CSS folder. Click on it. Click OK and it'll show up right here. Another cool feature that Dreamweaver offers is if you want to preview this style sheet before you place it, you can by clicking the preview button, which we're going to do right now. As you can see, this is what our style sheet will look like after we import it. I'm going to go ahead and click OK. Now that we've imported our index.css, knowing that it's an external style sheet because of the .css, we still have a little bit of a problem here. The problem is, is that all our text it looks like it's been laid out properly now because the style sheet has styled it. But this little header up here isn't just gonna, isn't going to do. We're going to delete that in a moment because we don't want that in here. But first I'm going to show you how to take that header, that style, and place it into the index.css style sheet. You can move styles from external style sheets to another external style sheet, from internal to external, from external to internal. You can move them all around. We'll go ahead and open up the style and we'll open up index.css. We're just going to grab that header, click and hold, drag it down, and as you see the little blue line, we can place this now inside the index.css. I'm going to place it at the top here. Now we've just moved that style that used to be internal into an external style sheet. We can check that by going into code view, scrolling up a little bit, and as you can see, here's the style. This is only here because this style is here but there is no style inside of it. Now we'll go back to the design view. We can delete this style right here. We don't need it any longer. Still, header is kind of ruining our page. We don't really like that there. So what we're going to do is we're going to delete the header style. We'll click on that. Now, the header style is gone, but the text is still here. So we'll go ahead and delete that text as well. We don't want that in there either. And again, we'll click right here and delete that and right now we've got exactly what we're looking for. By importing the external style sheet, it took all that mumble jumble that you saw in the middle of this page and turned it into something beautiful. Hope you learned something on importing external style sheets and we'll see you next time.